Okay, now for question number three. Um, here is a list of numbers. Put a ring around the number with the largest value. Okay, so you have 0 0.3030 and one third, and 0 0.0330, three tenths, and 33 percent. Now, the most sensible thing to do in order to compare these would be to write all of these as decimals and write them out to the same number of decimal places so that we can compare them. Now, one third is the same as 0 0.333. Okay, if you're not sure, you can just stick it in your calculator. One divided by three equals. This would come up, and then you press the SED button. I'll just show you in case you're not sure. Okay, so you have, you can put one over three, and you press equals, and you press this SED button. As you can see, 0 0.33333 recurring. So this is going to give us 0 0.3 recurring. But I'm going to write it out to four decimal places. I'll write 0 0.333 and 3. And it just follows that pattern. But I've written it to the four decimal places. This is already in decimals. 3 over 10 is going to be 0 0.3. 0 0.3. But just to help me compare, I'm just going to add three more decimal places. OK, again, if you're not too confident about that, which you should be, really, unless you have a very severe case of calculator writers, 3 divided by 10, 3 over 10. OK, you press the SED button, it gives you 0 0.3. And 33% simply means 33 over 100. OK, this is the same as 33 over 100. So you have 33 over 100. OK, which means you move the decimal place back two spaces, which is going to be 0 0.33. OK, and again, I'm going to put two zeros at the end to compare them. So when you compare them, OK, um, what you could do is write them down right on top of each other to make it clear. So you have 0 0.3030, and you have 0 0.3333, and you have 0 0.0330, and you have uh, 0 0.3, and you've got three zeros, and you've got 0 0.3. Three three zero zero. Of course, you can see that the the largest number is going to be the one which has, like, of course, you can see that this is zero point three. The second term is three in all of them in, in these ones. The ones that zeros are now become the smallest. This is the, this is of course the smallest, and the next one is going to be this, and the next one to be eliminated is going to be this one. So we can see the one that has the biggest value is going to be. 0 0.33333, which is corresponding to one third. So I'm going to put a ring around. It says put a ring around the number with the largest value. So to compare them, write them as decimals and then see which one is bigger. Okay, this one you can see obviously is the biggest one. Okay, because it's it has three tenths, three hundredths, three thousandths, and three ten thousandths. Whereas these have got less in some of those particular spaces. So that's the biggest value there. Okay, so then that, that's uh, done with question number three. Question number four you should find on the next video on the playlist.